Ah! Alright guys, today in this video... S what? Stop, I'm doing the intro. Seriously. I'm going to be uh, make, turning this into this. And it also lights up. What? What do you want? Hey dude, Santa isn't real. Ruining the intro. Five hundred! Oh! One! Ho! Oh, oh, ho! Oh, ho! Two! Ho! Oh, Mrs. Claus is gonna love me! Ho! Oh, oh. oh, ho! Oh. Ho! Wait, what? I ain't real? I'm Santa Claus! Goes I am! Oh, I'm gonna smack their little booties definitely on the naughty list! Ho! Oh, oh. Ho! Alright, everyone, let's start with this build. First, we need these metal wires. We're uh, putting some colours into this bonsai tree. <laughs> so, we're gonna have white, uh, so, yeah, white and uh, blue. And another one's gonna be right in red. So we got these two out. These ended up being very thin wires. So we ended up having to twist them together. As you can see what I'm doing right now. We have to twist them together to match out the other wire that was a bit thicker than this. But we made it really fun and a lot faster by putting it into the drill and just spinning it. This helped out so much because it would have took ages. Just I was thinking of just spinning every single one, but you gotta need a lot of these. So um, yeah, this drill technique definitely helped, and it was actually quite fun. So once you have all of them, we have to do the white ones. Um, yeah, just do the same amount. Then we also need a bucket with a few holes in the top. Already did this in the last video I made. You can you guys can check that out. Um, so yeah, once you do that, you could just go fill them all up right in the top. All She's done. all done there. Alright, so this is a little test piece. So you can do this before actually going ahead with the big project. But um, you don't go want to do the twist thing that I'm doing now with the real one. But first thing you're going to do, twist the main part, just get ready. And then after a while you go pull out a root. So just pull out like a couple out and then start twisting that and then you want to twist the main part again and start angling it as well. That's the best part to get the shape that you really want. Okay so it should start looking like this. So you just got to keep doing that so you pull out some more, pull it off to the side and you're going to want to twist those. And then Just for a little bit and then you twist more of the top, pull out some more. Twist those, twist the main, and just keep going until you get to the end while also trying to make it look like a bonsai tree. Best way is to have a picture of a bonsai tree right in front of you for reference, and you just keep going. Alright, so now we're finished with those rooting, we're going to cut them to size. This is something you're going to have to learn through experience on how long you're going to want to make this part, but these are going to be the leaves. And you're going to want to twist that to make them into loops. Just like every individual leaf is a loop. And um, it looks weird when you think about it when you do it. But at the end it actually starts to work out. So you just got to keep doing that until you get to a rough. When you're near to where you want to be. And after you've finished all of that. You've got to group them all up together. And that will be your leaves. There you go. That's it. And trust me, when it's all done, it all looks great. Trust me, I've done this before. I uh, wish I did this first, because this is the best version. So here it looks like, all done. Look at that. So this is a nice little ring piece. So I would start off doing this before doing the actual thing. Good tester piece. Kind of flimsy situation. Very flimsy. Not that arousing, then. No, that looks like <laughs> solid. <laughs> Alright, enough of those jokes. Now we're going back to the main tree now. So we're going to do the same as we did on that little part, but with the, the actual bit. So it's the exact same thing, you twist the bottom, you pull out the roots, keep going until you get to the end. It's the same thing. So um, I'm just going to time lapse this for you, Slot, and uh, <laughs> get on with it. Just to get
Okay, right, guys, so we finished. Looking pretty sick. Look at the blue and silver. We have to just take out now. So let's do that. Oh my god, here comes the boot. Here comes the boot. Here comes the boot. Your mandrake firmly, you pull it sharply up over the pot. Got it. And now, you dump it down into the other pot and pour a little sprinkle of the soil to keep it warm. Displeased, baby. <laughs> Displeased. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I'm gonna make this look like a candy cane. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so my other half is just gonna paint these bases that light up. We got them from Asda for eight pound each. One's a square, one's a circle tube one. So yeah, she's gonna paint it up and then we're gonna put the tree inside that and that will be our light source. Gotta be awesome. All right, so once you have the tree in the base, we're gonna fill it up with some green and white wire that's gonna look like grass, um, like snowy grass. Then once that's all done, we're gonna wrap the lights around the tree however way we want and um, that'll be it. The tree's done. Merry Christmas! Uh.